it's so tough. And of course, when we also look at, you know, things like commercial probiotic products and prebiotic products that are on the market all over the place, they're only addressing three or four types of bacterium that we need. And we should have, you know, and they, and our pets should have literally dozens, shouldn't they? Yeah, no, absolutely. I mean, the probiotics are often synthetic, you know, products that uh, include just a few strains, as you said. And it's important that uh, that animals have a wide variety of of healthy flora that if you're going to add to the to the diet. I know you talk all the time about food based sources of, you know, natural probiotics uh, rather than relying on these, you know, kind of packaged processed probiotics, so to speak. Well, you know, on the on the on the uh, process stuff, a lot of that stuff is pasteurized. And what is 